let's go down courtside now to Brett Phillips, who's ready to MC this presentation. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our official presentation. Would you please give it up for all four players on court today for a terrific tournament and doubles final. We are joined here on Rod Laver Arena by Tennis Australia Chair Jane Hurdlegger, Tournament Director Craig Tiley, Tournament Referee Wayne McEwen, and a big welcome to the winner of three Grand Slam tournaments, including the 1999 Australian Open Men's Doubles Championships, Pat Rafter, who will present the trophies today. I'd like to invite Jane Hurdlicker to present the chair umpire for this men's doubles final with a very special gift, Tom Sweeney from Australia. Well done, Tom. I'd now like to ask Pat Rafter to present the trophies to our finalists. They were last year's winners. It was magnificent to have them back here in the final. Rajiv Ram from the United States and Joe Salisbury from Great Britain. Firstly, just got to say a big congratulations to Ivan and Philip and, and all your team. I mean, that was uh, way too good today. One of the, it's got to be one of the best performances in a final ever. Uh, so congratulations. Thank uh, thanks again to Rajiv. Uh, we've had a great tournament. Uh, congrats to him on winning the mixed again last night. Um, and I'm sure, sure we'll go on from this. But yeah, it's been a great week. Thanks for, thanks for everything you've done. Um, just wanted to say a big thank you to all our team, uh, to Rob and Lazander here, um, to everybody back home, coaches, family, friends, everybody up in the middle of the night watching the matches um, and all their support. We couldn't do it without all of you, so big thanks. Um, and also to, <coughs> to Tennis Australia, to Craig and all your team, um, well done for putting on this tournament. I know uh, we're very lucky to be out here playing Grand Slam, playing tennis, traveling around the world um, in this situation. So uh, thanks for all your hard work. Uh, um, and also to all the sponsors, all the volunteers, the ball kids, um, everybody that, that makes this tournament happen. It's one of the best in the world, so thank you. Um, yeah, I, I don't have much more to add, uh, you know, thanks to everybody. I, I kind of said it last night, but uh, just for these guys, uh, Philip, I know it's your first uh, Grand Slam, so, you know, that, that was way too good, as Joe said. Uh, not sure what we could have done any different, so you guys played awesome. Um, and to my partner, Joe, uh, you know, this is, uh, this is just a start for us. We, we got much more to do. So thanks, everybody, for coming out. Again, it was great to play in front of fans, as I said yesterday, and we'll be back next year. Well done, Rajiv and Joe. We wish you all the very best for a very successful 2021. Well, ladies and gentlemen, to our winners, I'm going to ask Pat to come back up and present our 2021 Australian Open Men's Doubles Champions, their first Grand Slam doubles title as a team. You can hear the passion of the winner, Philip Polasek, the second Slovakian player, man or woman, to win a first Grand Slam title, and for Ivan Dodig, his second Grand Slam men's doubles title. Your champions for 2021. Yeah, uh, well, first of all, I would like to thank all of these uh, lovely people to come in these difficult times. And uh, uh, we are in really challenging uh, year, 
but still we are managing to run the tournament and uh, big big applause please for uh, Tennis Australia and the uh, tournament director Greg. Um, I would like to thank my partner uh, for these amazing memories and the great tennis we, we played here. Uh, since we start to play one and a half year, we are really enjoying and uh, playing a good tennis. And uh, this is our first uh, Grand Slam together and uh, we are having a lot of fun and hopefully it's going to still continue. Also, uh, to all our team, thank you guys a lot through all this year to... To my brother and uh, all our team to traveling in this difficult time, it's uh, challenging for everyone, but uh, uh, we love so much this sport and uh, hopefully this uh, will come soon to the normal. Uh, as well, I would like to thank all the people who organized this, uh, this event, who try to uh, do all the best, uh, uh, give us amazing service and uh, we all know how difficult it is, but uh, uh, we still manage to play and it's, it's always a great feeling to come back, especially here in Australia and uh, play in good tennis. Thank you very much and hopefully see you next year in the much better standing. Thank you. Hey everyone, uh, I have to start a bit different. I, I would like to thank to, to my fiance who just delivered me by the second daughter on Friday, two days ago. Then thanks, mom. I would like to congrats to Rajiv and uh, Joe. They had done the tournament last year, title this year final. They are very tough opponents and uh, wish you all the best for the rest of the season. Uh, thanks again to Tennis Australia and everyone involved in these tournaments to, to put together to these difficult days. It's, uh, it's just challenging and it's a tremendous effort. And I would like to also thank all the sponsors uh, to make it happen this event. And the last but not least, uh, I would like to thanks to our team, uh, Misho, Ivan's brother, Pavel, uh, and also the coaches at home, uh, Leo and Eric, and all the others who are helping us and uh, putting so much effort to, to make this happen. And uh, also thanks our families uh, around uh, who are sticking us uh, in the good and also bad times. Thanks very much. One more time, folks, let's give it up. Your 2021 men's doubles champions, they played a magnificent match. Ivan Dodig of Croatia and Filip Polasek of Slovakia. And the guys will now pose for some photos. It does conclude our official presentation. Thank you. Well, Incredible scenes, incredible feelings for Polasek and Dorig. Of course, uh, Dorig has won a major before, so he is well aware of what it means and, and what sort of impact it's had on his life. He was uh, the 2015 Roland Garros champion with Marcelo Melo. But for Philip, it's number one off the back of one of the most remarkable stories in tennis out of the game for five years, came back. But pure luck and fate uh, has intervened in the most beautiful of ways, not only on the court, but of course off of it, with uh, the birth of his second daughter just two days ago, Olivia. Tough one for Ram and Salisbury, but they understand that today something special happened on the other side of the court. There's not a whole lot that they could do I've had another exceptional tournament here in Australia, the defending champions. I gave it a good go. Rajiv Ram walks away, a winner in the mix, so that is some nice consolation for him. But for these guys, well, 
wonderful celebrations. And of course, uh, they will share 600,000 Australian dollars. Tell you what, it's a pretty good gig if you can get it. They beat the team that I think is the team that you're going to have to watch out for this year in Nikola Mektic and Matej Pavic. That was the big win in the semi-finals. And off the back of that win, I thought these guys would be in with a, a decent shot today. And they lit it up. Huge celebrations, I'm sure, back in Slovakia. Dominic Herbardi, of course, is watching this one, I'm sure. And Daniela Hanchakova, the only other Grand Slam winner from that country, of course, won four mixed titles, did Danny. And Yvonne becomes the very first male tennis player in Slovak tennis history to win a major.